afternoon everyone welcome to the brown cajun channel we are back at it with the video i know it's been a long time since i post anything i've just been busy that's all so my brother ended up buying a side by side might have been one of the worst purchases he ever did hate to say it but this company is junk side by side is junk everything on this is junk i don't understand why would they build something like this hmm it looks cool it's about it so when he purchased it after a few months after he's having it, he started having some electrical issue some starting issues so brought it back to the shop to get it fixed they couldn't fix it sent somebody from overseas to come by and try to fix it still couldn't fix it and up putting a new harness in it which took him almost three and a half months to do probably longer than that so we just got it back last weekend and it ain't been moved off the trailer so i went to go pick it up and I'm going to show you what kind of work they did. Here's this piece of pile of junk. Yes, I'm talking about the MXU Warrior. Warrior my butt. Look at this. Look at this. They just let it hang there. This is from the manufacturer that installed all this stuff. You took it, we took it to, they took it to the manufacturer to have all this stuff reinstalled. And this is how they gave it back to them. I don't know if you can see. That plug's not even plugged up. There's another plug that's not plugged up. You see right there? That's not plugged up. That's not plugged up. Try to put them together. They won't even lock. So I decided to lift the trunk up. Well, I didn't even want to put the nut and bolt back through it. What kind of manufacturer let something like this go? Big pile of junk. Been trying to get in touch with the manufacturer, but nobody's answering their phones. Uh, I wish they would just give us the money back for it. I mean, it's been in the shop for over six months. Oh, let me show you. So, see powers on. Look. When did this work? None of it works. Can't even hear it doing anything. So now I gotta go tear all this stuff apart to try to fix everything. Why would a manufacturer let something like this go out the door and tell them it's ready for pickup and leave crap like this laying around? Boy, this big pile of junk. Don't ever, ever buy this junk. Because you're not going to even get your money back. Look at this. Look at this crap. My brother said he barely hit a piece of rock or something. And it ripped all this plastic off already. Big pile of junk. They put the slowest motor in there. Hmm. That's all I gotta say. Is do not buy this piece of junk. Spend your money and get some quality. See if motor. 
is a thousand times better than this. And then you just imagine working on this. How many freaking screws you gotta pull apart to do anything on it? This is all unnecessary. But that's all I gotta say. Peace out. See you later.